Hello friends, welcome back. In the last video, we had seen what exponents are. Exponent is expressed this way. 4 to the power of 2. Here, I call 4 as the base and 2 as the exponent or index. When I say 4 to the power of 2, it means 4 multiplied 2 times. 4 into 4, which is 16. The number 4 is the base that is being multiplied and the exponent is the number of times the base is being multiplied. Today, we are going to see roots, which is the inverse operation for exponents. That is, it is the opposite of exponents. symbol but it is not the same. So here when I say find the square root of 16 or square root is nothing but root and you write 2 here and 16 inside the square. Here what it means is some number that is being multiplied 2 times is giving you 16. You have to find the number. The exponent in our example is going inside that root symbol. The answer is inside, well inside the root symbol. So which number if you multiply 2 times will give you 16? Well if you know the multiplication tables you know it is 4. 4 into 4 is giving you 16. Let me take another example. While seeing exponents we have seen the common exponents used are 2 and 3. That is, you square a number means you multiply it twice. You cube a number is multiplied three times. So 2 and 3 were the most common exponents. Similarly, when I say square root, it means which number multiplied two times give you this answer. When I say cube root, which number when multiplied three times is giving you this answer. Now if I were to find the cube root of 8, which number when multiplied 3 times is giving you 8? Think, if you know the multiplication tables, you know 2 into 2 into 2 gives you 8. So the answer for this will be 2. But it is not always so simple to find the square root or the cube root or the fourth root. Why? Because, for example, if I have to find the cube root of 16, which number multiplied 3 times is giving you 16? Even I don't know the answer. I'll have to use a scientific calculator or some advanced calculation to find the same. But in case of perfect squares, it's very simple to find the square root. For example, when I have to find the square root of 25, which number when multiplied 2 times is giving you 25. If you know the multiplication tables, you know 5 into 5 is 25. Which number when multiplied 2 times give you 49? This square root of 49, 7 into 7 is 49. So friends, I hope you understood what square roots and cube roots are. Thank you for watching.